So I got uh, Emily off to school today and uh, go home, finish my coffee, and uh, gotta work on some music. I have a gig this weekend. So uh, a couple of tunes on the set list I've never played before. I gotta learn some others I haven't played in years and gotta brush up on. Oh my goodness. So uh just finished up rehearsal with Fuzz Huzzy. Um we got that show coming up on the 18th, opening for Struggle Jennings. And uh we're a pretty physical band, so even the rehearsals can wear you out a little bit. I'm a little bit tired, but I haven't uh been out and played cards for a few days, so it is time. I skipped Saturday and then we had the home game with the friends Sunday. So today is time, I think. Sitting and waiting and sitting and waiting. It's Monday. There's one table of one three going. I'm second on the list. Here's my prediction. I'm gonna sit here for like an hour I'm gonna get on the table, finally, and the game's gonna break 90 minutes later. What do you think, 90 minutes? No, not that long. Not that long? No. An hour? Yeah. Yeah? All right, game will break an hour after I get my seat. Good news is, Barona is still in the holiday spirit here in the poker room. Christmas tree. We wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas on the 6th of January and it's past the new year. So my prediction was wrong. The game didn't break 90 minutes after I got there. Mike was also wrong. It didn't break an hour after I got there. In fact, the game is still going, but I ran absolutely terribly. Um, one hand I had that I actually got stacked with is, uh, and I'm in the cutoff and raised with a eight, seven of spades. Flop comes out five of spades, three of spades, six of clubs. So I have a huge combo draw and I brick. All right, Mikey's here. I can get my, uh, I can get my ticket. Get a lottery ticket now. What are my lucky numbers? 21, 22, 23, 36. Oh, it's one of those sequential ones. So both kids are now dropped off at school. Walking both to school in two different directions on Tuesdays and Fridays. And then just Emily goes to school on, you know, she goes all five days. Now time to hit the gym. change of scenery today. We're at Saquon playing the 2-3 No Limit Hold'em and uh, so far it's going pretty good. I uh, got lucky, flopped trips, one hand with a um, 9-8 suited that I decided to raise with and ended up winning a pretty good sized pot. But yeah, so far so good. That did not go well. Uh, I three bet to 80 pre-flop with jacks over like a 25 open and uh, got two callers, so a nice big pot. Uh, flop comes out, jack eight, six. And uh, I bet, guy shoves. We get it all in on the flop. He's got a 10-7, catches a nine on the river. Not sure <laughs> how he, uh, wound up taking a flop for uh, 80 bucks with 10.7 but hey he did that's the only thing that matters so uh we were up earlier and uh we're leaving not up anymore <laughs> Six, what's seven, up eight. he's filming something i know he's I doing know. something hey 
Derek just stuck his tongue at you. You. <laughs> you and you and you and you and you. You know what's funny is Corey, Corey, um, Corey is the one that edits our videos. So if you think they're awesome, let Corey know. Yeah, let me know. Because I love. To edit video. No, 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 no. Not that. Video I editor. love to have my ego fed. <laughs> I love it. I love to be able to do something like edit a video, you know, something that nobody in their right mind would ever think I could do and have somebody be like, damn, that video looks good. And I'll be like, yeah. I don't want to work good. I want to bang on my drum all day. Here we go. Here we go. I'm going to do one with it. One on it. Drum one handed, one with the camera. Here we go. Uh, We're back at the home base tonight. So two nights in a row over at Sequan. Back to Barona. We got the lottery tonight. I'm still gonna win. They still have their Christmas tree up? No, they took it down. Oh, they finally got around to taking it down. So sometime between January 6th and now, they took down their tree. Yay, congratulations. Barona poker, always on the ball. All right, so uh, we are doing a little backyard birthday party tonight. It's like a, a pickup gig. Me, my buddy Eric Deland is here, and uh, our friend Art, and our new friend Adrian. And I'm playing guitar tonight instead of drums, so that'll be fun. It's been a little while. I haven't played like a gig on electric guitar in yo since June, maybe. Wow. All right. It's been a while, huh? Yeah. I got the strat. Since June? Yeah. I have a strat tonight. Oh, that explains why you sound like crap. It does. Absolutely. <laughs> I've taken a couple of days off uh, from poker. You know, I had the gig yesterday. I took Friday off. So last time I played was Thursday. And it was, uh, it was a short session, but it was just a little rough. Um, I played a pot i had kings and uh i feel like i played the hand really well i don't remember all the details but um you know i felt like i was getting good value and just really making the other guy play defensively and, and all this kind of stuff and he also had kings uh it's like the third time in maybe two or three months that i've chopped with big pairs so i've had aces against aces two times and now i've had kings against kings yeah what you gonna do it happens and then uh you know I, I had built up my stack pretty good after that not like huge but i was i don't know maybe up like uh 50 big blinds or something and uh then i got a set under set sevens against queens on a king queen seven two spades board I doubled him up you're just gonna you're just gonna lose a big pot most of the time when you have set under set it's just what happens so anyway any of these things in a vacuum doesn't really seem like that big of a deal and wouldn't really bother me too much but uh, the end of December and so far starting through January uh, things are definitely not going my way I'm a little frustrated uh, I'm not like fully tilty or anything but I definitely want to take a little bit of uh, care with my bankroll and not just go ahead and just keep going out there and playing and, and not feel like I'm at my mentally strongest. I hope you've had a really great week. Uh, my week other than just running bad has been fantastic. So I hope that yours was as well. And uh, here's to even better next week. Got a big com uh, big show coming up on Saturday. Open for Struggle Jennings. That's going to be good. So what are you up to this week? Don't forget to like and subscribe and share this with your poker playing friends if you think they'll like it. And uh, leave a comment. Let me know what you're doing this week. All right. Talk to you later.